Today we're talking about uh, Deacon's Vestments. My name is Deacon Zav, and uh, it's a pleasure to be here with you. So first we've got uh, what's called the Amos. Now each one of these vestments has a prayer that goes along with it. This one here is, Lord, set on me the helmet of salvation to fend off the assaults of the devil. The purpose of the Amos is just to cover the street clothes and to protect the collar of the alb. Um, in the old days, soldiers wore this into battle. And firemen wear it today to protect themselves when they go into fires. There's the Amos. Then we have what's called the alb. And the alb is the, the main vestment, again, to cover the street clothes, prepare myself for the sacred liturgy. And the prayer is, Lord, cleanse my heart and purify my desires, that washed in the blood of the Lamb, I may yet enjoy eternal bliss. Next, we have the cincture. Well, the cincture holds the alb in place, and the prayer goes like this. Lord, gird me with the cincture of purity. Extinguish my fleshy desires, that the virtue of chastity may abide within me. Next, we have the stole. And the deacon's stole is a little different than the priest's stole. It's worn across like a sash over your left shoulder. Lord, restore the stole of immortality that I lost through the collusion of my first parents. And as I approach these sacred mysteries, may I yet gain eternal joy. Finally, we have what's called a dalmatic. And the dalmatic is a lot like a chasuble that a priest wears except the dalmatic has sleeves to distinguish it from the chasuble. Lord, endow me with the garment of salvation, the vestment of joy, and may the dalmatic of justice ever encompass me. <laughs>